Wow. Thank God we got somebody else. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> you can go now, Steve. Thanks for escorting Rodney here. Uh, again, it's my show, and you were the guest. <laughs> your show. It's our show. It's our show. It's I'll give you that. It's our show. We have our guest, Rodney Charters. We do. We just saw Rodney outside, and we're like... He used to be a part of it. If you don't know who Rodney is, what the hell are you doing? Yeah, Rodney's <laughs> going to give you some real advice, <laughs> not our <laughs> advice. We actually have a professional with us today. Yes. Rodney Why don't you has tell shot some of the best TV shows out there. He's one of the hardest working men in the business. Oh my and God, he, he is. is <laughs> <laughs> Enough I, already. I he's tell you, nice, don't he's work nice so guy. hard. I I know, know. He's a nice guy too. Yeah, I don't he's the things. best. We he's go on road trips to together. He's like, How come you don't go on the road trips with us? Have you never invite me. Oh, well, would you go? We're going to Cuba. Are you going to be there? Yes. So be yeah, there. yeah. I'm, try, I'm trying to take him to Cuba. You've I think we should go to me. Cuba. We're all going. Him. Very few Americans have gone to Cuba. Right. It's kind of a fun trip. Mm. Bruce, him, yeah. the buoys, you know, us. I can go because you can yeah, go. Yeah. You've got, uh, you still got a Kiwi Canadian passport. passport. Yeah. yeah. What's your passport? I'm getting a Spanish passport, but that's a whole other well, story. Be your first, this must be your first trip abroad, right? Out of the States. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm alright because I can go to Cuba. Uh, well, give some of Rodney's credits so some people know. Well, uh, Rodney's uh, probably your claim to fame must be 24. Yep. Uh, you shot the, the original nine seasons, was it? Yep. All on 35. Mm. Yep. Mill film. Yep. And you did um, Shameless. Yep. The, Eng- the American version. The American version yeah. is not the, the, uh, the, good the English one. one. Not the good one. No, I know. The, the, English, one's the English one's great. <laughs> it's great, but you need to be foreign yeah. to understand. You need subtitles. Yeah. I mean, and, you're cu- and, you are, and you're still shooting Dallas. Dallas. Right and, now. Uh, Nashville. He Nashville, did the Nashville, Nashville pilot and a bunch of Charlie's shows, Angels. You know. Basically, uh, Rodney is... Everything. Is, <laughs> Roswell. Yeah. I've known Rodney for Roswell. a few years now, and he's... Yeah. he's such a lovely when I first I didn't even know Rodney I uh, never met him but he invited me to the set of 20 that's right and that the sneaky time. bugger took a picture on set Ooh. and posted it that it night was, oh, oh, but it was just with the big camera <laughs> I, I was like it was the beginning of trouble for me. Yeah, right. <laughs> but, but tweeting. <laughs> if he hadn't done it, you would have done it. No. <laughs> yes. It was you, no, maybe. You know what I was doing. Okay. So I was with the, the big 35 mil We rig. do have to yeah, say that. Yeah, that's right. That's Picture on your set. Yeah, it was like, yeah, look, I know what the hell I'm doing. Yeah, yeah. look We have to say that you're, all, you're always getting into trouble anyway, yeah, so yeah, you don't yeah. need him to I help you with that. No, no. <laughs> getting into trouble means you're doing the right thing. Yeah. If you're not getting into trouble, then you're playing it too safe. I actually publicly went online to say, why 4K today? And expressed fully clearly and articulated why. I think it's not a good thing. I reckon you go 4K. Although anyway. it would be interesting to tell people that Rodney is a ProRes fan and tell them about on television. ProRes. You Pro shoot ProRes Pro runs. You shoot. Ele- you own Alexa and you yes. shoot Alexa. Yes. How much do you shoot RAW? Uh, ProRes. It's all ProRes. Yeah, exactly. And this is the yeah. thing: is that you have so much obsession with RAW. Yeah. Not just 4K, but with RAW. Yeah. And the reality is, in the business. We almost no, no, shoot. but all the features are raw. Yeah, features, but people yeah. are shooting lower end stuff. No, television. If Tell TV them about TV television. ProRes rules, it. and and I think a lot of low budget features will go ProRes rather yeah. than worry about codecs and XT. Yeah. Because that additional cost, they can't justify it. Because when you actually go up to the screen, it's like you're nitpicking about what's better. Well, it's like, you know, look at Game of Thrones. The first season, I believe, was shot 422. Yeah. Even 4444. Yeah, but, but the it's last JPEG season was 2000. And the last season was shot raw and yes. I look <laughs> can you tell the difference yeah Not it's really television yeah. man it's it looks fantastic it, okay but we but need to do to our show here anyway so that. just a quick warning just in case we have the same we have the same thing as yesterday this potentially could be not safe for work so if you are watching this at work just to let you know we accidentally did show breasts not Steve's breasts thankfully yeah um, oh. It was not <laughs> not deliberate. It was basically the guys over there in the gallery. We asked them to pick a video, and of course, yes. you yeah. don't ever ever ask people. Tell them about there. the random nature of things. It, it is very random. We have a long list of uh, stuff from Vimeo, and we are going to just pick, pick. one and see how it goes. And so go and pick. We already have one picked, and we're going to play it right now. Let's do it. Now we've never seen this.
Okay, Phil. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to take that in right now. Well, um, I don't know. This is, this is where I always ask you. I'm kind of an idiot. I have no idea what that was about. Can you explain it? That that was clearly a social commentary film about the state of the uh, the the, uh, <laughs> the, the economy <laughs> in the USA. I don't bloody know. What the hell was that about? I have no idea. Well, no, you mean, must know what that was about. Rage. Clearly. That's what it was about. Rage, was it? Rage. Was it? Rage about what, though? Yeah. The machine, the system. I don't know. Rage against the, the machine. The futility of life. It could be. It was yep. rather long. It was, it was way too it long. Been, I don't think it could have been trimmed much. What I'm trying to be nice. I'm just a guess. Yeah, no, no. I'm just a guess. No, no. We want to be absolutely no, okay, so honest. Okay, you go in there and you cut a quarter and you keep a quarter. Three quarters of every take goes away, straight away. Yeah. And then you kind of collate them in a more meaningful manner. It was like aggressively taking me on a story and then it got lost and I'm like, oh, I get to reorientate myself. I didn't know who the character was in the very beginning. I didn't see his face. No. I didn't know that that was the same guy that ran into his shower, you know? It was like, the story needs to be told. But there is beginning, no story. middle, end. Ooh! There was... <laughs> <laughs> there was a. He did it to you, man. There you was a. You won't, no, you, <laughs> you start with the beginning, middle, and then, and maybe you. I say them. that and you flame me. No, not at all. I'm saying <laughs> I think it's you good. It's good to certainly aim for that. You don't always have to have it. It's there. It's a. It's like the, you know the rules. They're there, but you know. The, 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 you have to start with a story. There has to be a message. You have yes. to have a journey or a quest yes. or yes. something. Yes. It wasn't yes. there. The quest it, was to eat lots of bad food. No, and get angry. You you have to. No, but it's like a conversation with someone. Somebody. That's not how you converse and communicate. I've met people do that. I, I <laughs> grant you that. <laughs> but if that was a worthy attempt, it was too long. 
Yeah. But I'm not. I'm going to go further. That you have to. Th there has to be a story. You can't just be enraged for six minutes. Yes, you need it. You need a reason for the rage, and you let it flow Thank forwards. You. And I and I and it could have. There was an increase. It got worse and worse. Yeah, but okay. I mean, to talking about this is insanity because. There's, there's no definitive story that we know what it is, so you need to create a story, whether you make it long, short, yeah. whatever. That was just yeah. more yeah. painful yeah. because right. it was longer. Without I, a story, I know, you I know, don't engage. I, I know a very small amount of information about this. All I know, this was actually made from crowdfunding. Was it the Angry Film was Festival? Raised oh my God! To make that on seriously. Kickstarter. See, this upsets me because you. What uh, was the premise that they put out on cl know, what's it, what's cloud? In the, what's in the text? Uh, I haven't got the text in oh. front of me. Uh, <coughs> Maybe you can ask them to give you the text yeah, we while we're talking here. Yeah, it's but it's it, you know. It's what upsets me is is that a lot of people would really like six thousand dollars, and if you have six thousand dollars, you should. It always starts with a story that's written by a writer yeah. that's gone yeah. through some yeah. sort of yeah. editing, yeah. you know, script doctoring that has either a journey or a quest or you know it's a boy meets girl boy gets something. Mm. You have to have a formula, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Story, cast, and performance. It did have had no story. Right. The cast was there. Mm. Performance was variable. Right. Okay, let's and move on. And also, from a cinematic point of view, we've got more information. Visually, yeah, it wasn't we've got some information. No, and on, and information actually, about it. wait, wait. So Rodney made a point here. was a young man tries to self-justify that he's a good person, <coughs> only to spiral into primitive urges leaving his mark all over Chicago. Well, there you are. I did exactly that. And I said, your hometown as well. I didn't even notice it was it Chicago. Made me you know, like there all the time. No, I knew it was Chicago. Oh, okay, wow. I shot wow. Shameless in that city. Trust me. Okay. I know you those places. I've lived there for know. 30 years and I didn't know it was Chicago. Okay. <laughs> all right. So you didn't even convey the location well. But okay, so the point is... I'm amazed at something like that because, you know, I get asked the, the, a lot the, about the, Kickstarter. I want my film being made. You know, what, can The you, public can didn't you? hear what he just told you, though. No, that went out to the public. Oh, it did. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay. So, yeah. I mean, it's. Uh, I think we should move on. I think yeah, let's move on. I mean, yeah. we don't want to flame anybody, but no. the fact that you had six thousand dollars and that was your choice but upsets you, me. From the description, it kind of fulfills the premise of the description in a way. Uh, it's just not the sort of thing that I would. It's not really my yeah. cup of tea. Okay, as let's move on. We're yep. something called uh, "If Tomorrow Starts Without Me." It's number seven on that list. Okay. All I know about is from information, it says it has beautiful cinematography. All right, it's well. Okay. All right, we'll check it out. When tomorrow starts without me, and I'm not there to see, if the sun should rise and find your eyes all filled with tears for me, I wish so much you wouldn't cry the way you did today while thinking of the many things we didn't get to say. I know how much you love me as much as I love you and each time that you think of me I know you'll miss me too. But when tomorrow starts without me please try to understand that an angel came and called my name and took me by the hand and said my place was ready in heaven far above and that I'd have to leave behind all those I dearly love. But as I turned to walk away a tear fell from my eye for all my life I'd always thought I didn't want to die. I had so much to live for so much left yet to do it seemed almost impossible that I was leaving you. I thought of all the yesterdays, the good ones and the bad. I thought of all the love we shared and all the fun we had. If I could relive yesterday, just even for a while, I'd say goodbye and kiss you and maybe see you smile. But then I fully realized that this could never be emptiness and memories would take the place of me. And when I thought of worldly things I might miss come tomorrow, I thought of you. And when I did, my heart was filled with sorrow. But when I walked through heaven's gates, I felt so much at home. 
When God looked down and smiled at me from his great golden throne, he said, this is eternity and all I've promised you. Today, your life on earth is past, but here, life starts anew. I promise no tomorrow, but today will always last. And since each day is the same, there's no longing for the past. You have been so faithful, so trusting, and so true. Though there were times you did some things you knew you shouldn't do. But you have been forgiven, and now at last, you're free. So won't you come and take my hand, and share my life with me? Well, that was polar opposite to the last one and wow. style and feel for certain. Yeah. stunning yeah stunning it felt like uh uh like shell sherman or uh, you know the the poetry was beautiful mm. god i loved that it. it was so closely mic'd that mm. if it wasn't closely mic'd yeah. like that yeah. it was a oh, rodney's crying yeah, it yeah. Wasn't, he always cries. got me oh, got me he oh, always cries me rodney cries it I, I get Trek. emotional a good movie yeah. Star Trek you know good emotional. film <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Well, you know, when, I, when it even moved me a lot, and I'm cold. You know that. You are a cold fish. Yeah, it, it was. Now the, the essential thing here is the guy chose something that was pre-existent that worked mm -hmm. on paper, mm -hmm. and then he visualized it. It's beautiful. It was beautiful. I mean, the the sound. The only thing, if I would make like a criticism, which I don't necessarily want to, because it was so stellar, it was a wee bit long for me. Yeah. Yeah. And well, the poem's that long. I mean, once yeah. you commit to that, yeah, that's true. That's a problem. And I w and it could have been really spectacular if it had a wonderful sound design to it. Wouldn't that have been kind of nice to have uh, all of those lovely little sound effects? I don't know. I, that's yeah, just yeah. my opinion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, it was just. I give him a triple plus. It was just beautiful. I, I, I love the lo location that he chose to because it's so uncharacteristic mm -hmm. for those of us in the West to see that aging process Good. in a country like yeah, that. Yeah, looking at uh, the information here, it was shot in India, Vietnam, Senegal, and Morocco. Yeah. Yeah. Fantastic. What did you think of the cinematography? It was beautiful. It was gorgeous. Yeah. I mean, you'd be yeah, proud yeah. to do work like oh, that. Oh, yeah. No, absolutely. Do you know what made it look so good? It was shot in 4K. <laughs> 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 that was HD. It wouldn't have worked. Yeah, yeah, yeah right. right, right, right. What we was it? Does it say what it was shot on? Like, yeah, we care? Yeah, 1 DC in 4K. Yeah. It all did, really? Yeah. yeah. Oh, good for well, him. how are we going to on this little computer screen? But it, it looked great anyway. Really? Anyways. You can't tell a difference? What's yeah, right. You? No. No. Yeah. No, it's can't. Wow. You can't. I, I, yeah. I, we were proud to show that piece. That yeah. was a privilege to watch. That's really yeah. lovely. It's definitely worth you know, watching it again. And I said this I said this every single episode. If you can, watch this sort of stuff. Not on your iPad or your iPhone yeah. Yeah. or your laptop. Put it onto your Apple TV or your smart Who's TV. Who's the director? Is that? Uh, it is uh, Camille Marotte. All right, Camille, I'm posting that on my website. That uh, is, is that something to be proud of. Yeah. Is that streaming in 4K? Can you can you download it, it in 4K? Yeah, uh, you know I mean, uh, it's not not available for download on the Vimeo. No, it's no, it's not being allowed. The one the one DC is quite a lovely camera. It's nice. I, yeah. I have one. I think yeah. it's a very lovely camera. Yeah. Yeah. But, I mean, the key thing, of course, was that was just beautifully made. Yes. Really yeah. well realized. I mean, the thing is, yeah. is a guy with that kind of talent, you could give him an iPhone and it would look the same. You know well, that. could be a lady, you know. Camille. There's Camille lensing. Camille. There's lensing, but Camille I mean. It's generally a French uh, a female name, so it could be. Yeah. A girl. What, okay. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. I so don't care, you know. Oh, <laughs> no, gotcha. Yeah. Uh, yeah, is, yeah, but again, had he used this a, a GH4, it would have looked the same. It's only been online um, a week, so color spec it's worth maybe checking different. out, yeah. so definitely. We're going to watch something completely different next, called Flash. Okay. okay. Yeah, you up for a bit of flashing? Sure. You might be flashy. We're going to show that next. I don't know what this was shot on, but we don't really care. <laughs> well done. <laughs> yeah. All right, Emma. Chris isn't here. Oh. Can I come in? Take a seat. <laughs> Screw it. Emma, 
I've always thought that you have the most beautiful body in the world. Now, I'm not going to ask you to do anything wrong, and I'll never tell a soul, I swear to God. What are you talking about? Show us your boobs. Get out! I'll give you £100, right? I'll leave straight after. I'll never come back again. No! £100. One boob. Like a goddess. I always knew you were a freak. Get out. I've got another hundred quid here. No. But but I need to see the other one. Oh, Jesus, just give me the money. Oh. That was the best moment of my life. Everything's downhill from here. I think I'm going to kill myself. Bye then. Hi, babe. Hey. Dave popped in for you. Oh, did he? Did he bring like 200 quid? He owes me. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> That's brilliant. Yeah, nice punchline. When he said there's 30 seconds left, I was going to say there's no resolution to this story, but then they had it. It was great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Smile on our face, that, didn't we? Yeah. What? He was smiling on your face for that, didn't well, you? So we both did. Yeah, it was cute. I was saying it's good. It's, it's, he did exactly what he needed to do. Good storytelling. Yeah, it was yeah. Like precise, controlled, carefully made, tight, right length. Yeah, total right length. Yeah, you had to have that and a the second longer. And the performances were pretty good too. Yes. They were good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Steve wasn't sure about the camera angles. You thought perhaps there should have been uh, maybe the reverse. Shot. <laughs> no, actually, what I was hoping is that they would do on the second boob that they would go oh, the uh, behind him. It's interesting. Still, point. that you can't see them, but you can kind of catch a corner yeah, 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 there. I know what you mean. Would have been yeah, nice yeah, yeah. there so on the second one. Basically, you're saying would have been you'd have given a you know high racing if there'd been a side boob. Is that what you're saying? I, 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 yeah, just so maybe. that we can see. Damn it, we want to see. He's getting a hundred quid for it. We want to see it. That's the whole point, though. Yesterday we we saw not we saw it, a, just a, a corner a man, of it. But this one we didn't see anything. But it was much, you know. Yeah, yeah. oh no, this was yeah. great. What made it good was the fact you didn't see it. I think yeah. that's what, if he had yeah. seen no, it, no, it wouldn't have been it. as good. No, 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 but there is, there are the, the other angle is a better yeah, tease. He's like I me. mean, it's adding on to yeah. the tease. I, I think in terms Side of boob. staging things like this, it's really, really useful in editorial yeah. to have jumped the axis mm -hmm. and to cover the other side, even though you don't necessarily plan on using it, you have it in case you feel that that would just push it up a ramp, you know? True. Well, this, this is advice they need to listen to because this is what Rodney does every single day. You're on set. Well, and then, no, plus, but also I'm directing a lot more now, so I, yeah. I totally... <clears throat> yeah. That in editorial, after you leave and everyone's taken the cameras and you lost the location and everyone's gone on holiday, you're in deep trouble if you don't have that extra little yeah. piece. I hear you. In your bucket, you know? Okay, who was the director of that? I don't know the director of that. I don't have it up on here. Let me see if I might be able to get it for you. Hold on. Nice to have a bit of England in there, though, I thought. That was, yeah, yeah. Yeah. That was English, but yeah. I didn't Yes, it was, it. in case Will, you were Will I'm wondering. Herbert. Will Herbert was the director. Okay. And Dan Will? Nightingale was the DP. That'll, that'll get him a commercial assignment. Yeah, it was well done. Yeah, it was really nice. Yeah. Really good. You know, we got n uh, basically the sound was good. Everything was good. Yeah. I, I liked it. I really yeah. enjoyed that. We're going to watch something which... What was that shot on, by the way? What did they say? Uh, I don't think it says. <coughs> I think, which is good. It doesn't say. Yeah, yeah we doesn't don't care. Matter. I it get you. Matter. Yeah. It doesn't, but you bought it, it up does last not. time. So well, he did not. because they listed yeah. it, but okay. yeah, and it was so spectacular. Was because, you know, it was 4K. About 4K. Yeah, right. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. It yeah. didn't make any difference care. on this we screen. We don't care. Now, I have no idea what this next one's about. The title okay. leaves, uh, it's a complete mystery. It's one of these things that could be about anything. It's called Pickpocket Huntress of Barcelona's Subways. Oh. <laughs> I have no idea what it's about. <laughs> it's one of these things that could be about anything. What do you think, Steve? Do you think it's any clue what this could be about? You know me. I like to go blind. I Whatever like it is. Maybe description is probably too descriptive. Perhaps. Well, yeah, it'll, it'll it. all depend. Like, we let's had a description it. yesterday that had nothing to do with the piece, but it was actually kind of cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know. No, well, let's watch it and find out. Okay. Son 
tocar, te dice esos tres que van delante. Pit Pocket, cuidado, Pit Pocket. Tenemos tres carteristas al final del, están escondidos en el pasillo, no quieren salir. Siempre mi madre me ha dicho, una sola golondrina no hace verano. O Se necesita mucha más gente para cambiar las cosas, pero yo pienso que no. Que una persona puede decir, mira, aquí pasa algo malo, llamar la atención y que más gente se te una con el tiempo. Pero alguien tiene que tomar la iniciativa. Yo intento solucionar las cosas que me afectan directamente. A mí los carteristas me afectan directamente. Porque yo adoro Barcelona. Barcelona vive del turismo. Un día que caí en cuenta de que habían tantos carteristas y si nadie hace nada. Y fue el día de que vi cómo robaban un estuche de insulina a unos turistas mayores. Y dije, no, alguien tiene que hacer algo. Spray de pimienta, cable para defenderme. Pinzas de defensa personal. Mi silbato, alarma. Teléfono para estar en contacto con policías. El kit para camuflarme de turista. Siempre hago la línea verde. ¿Por qué? Porque es la línea que te conecta desde el aeropuerto, es la línea que mueve a los turistas por excelencia. Y claro, ¿dónde mejor sitio para un carterista? El lenguaje corporal lo es todo. Una persona que está esperando el metro y que es una persona honesta y que no tiene ninguna intención de robar a nadie, pues está o con su teléfono o simplemente muy distendido. Un carterista, para él es su trabajo y tiene que estar atento cuál es la posible víctima y está vigilando constantemente. Estos son momentos cruciales, la gente está saliendo, las, los que quieren entrar y ellos aprovechan este momento para crear un tapón y robar a las personas que entran y ellos automáticamente se quedan en el andén, no abordan el metro, no van en el vagón, se quedan fuera y escapan. Escaleras mecánicas son vitales, vigilar muchísimo, llevar la mano sobre las cosas porque aprovechan cualquier descuido para sacarte todo. Cuando amenora la velocidad yo voy en la ventanilla y desde ahí escaneo lo que yo llamo escanear el andén. Yo controlo todas las caras, pero muy rápidamente, ya tengo adiestrado el ojo después de cuatro años vigilando, pues yo desde acá, desde el primer vagón, hago sonar el silbato. Venga, fuera. Venga. Pit pocket. Cómele el culo. Pit pocket. Pit pocket. Cuidado. Los hemos visto, les he hecho sonar el silbato. Estos son habituales, son muy conocidos de, la, de esta línea. Estos llevan cuatro años operando en esta línea constantemente, entonces son súper conocidos. La relación que tengo con el personal de TMB y con el personal de seguridad es buenísima. Yo creo que más que todo soy un refuerzo. Jefe se lo toma de que nos está quitando el trabajo a nosotros. que le dan a las pizzas no, a mí, a mí, ya digo, ojalá hubiese más gente como ella. Hola, tu bolso delante. Pit pocket, dos pit pocket. El bolso delante, ella. Ok. Pit pocket. Los carteristas acechan en todas partes. Pit pocket, oído. La gente tiene que entender la palabra altruismo. Si yo en el metro cada día evito dos, tres, cuatro robos. Oye, gente que esa experiencia no la vive, que se va de Barcelona sin que le roben y que va a recomendar Barcelona. Did I miss the bit where mm. she's doing that off completely off her own back? She's not yeah. been hired to do that. That's her. She That's just goes just her. herself. Yeah, three hours a day. Crazy. I mean, it's great, but crazy. Yeah, That's but it's, you know. it's good. It told the story really well. I thought. Yeah. I mean, we talked about this before. They took a personal uh, approach, which yeah. is good. You know, we get a lot of these documentaries yeah. Yeah. where yeah. it's more of an editorial story, and it doesn't follow a person, which is more interesting. Yeah. 
I don't know. I have some issues. I mean, I thought it was very good. To me, it was like... Um, I'm trying to think of what I feel. Uh, I feel like it's a very good piece for them to show to tourists when they come there. It was a little editorial for me. I would have loved to have seen something that, and it's a great piece. I don't want to say it wasn't, but I would have loved to have seen something that's a little more personal. Try to get a little more tear out of my eye, just myself. Maybe know a bit more, you know, why she more why she's doing it, why she's doing it, and the effect it maybe you know. Is it maybe can I know her m more as a person, perhaps. Thank you. That's, That's what, what I was did. trying to say. She talks about altruism. Let's hear yeah. more about her beliefs in life. So it's not just such an editorial. This is what Engaging, I do. You know. Yeah. You know, it's yeah. like I do this, I do that, I do this. End of yeah. story. Yeah. Interesting. Why she's got to that point? Why she's doing it? There must be some story behind it. There must be no, much no, more. No, she it. said she feels that I love the city and yeah. I want the city be to be have a better that, image to it. I think, you know, but I want to see her walking around the city. I want to see her love of the city. That and yeah. some of that needs to be kind of beautifully photographed, just yeah, a little yeah, she bit. She could have she could have presented us with Barcelona. Why why I love the city? Exactly you know, the vision of it and the beauty of it. Almost and with then the take narration. Us into the subway. But actually, it started well. I, I didn't have a problem with yeah. the start of it. It was kind of engaging. Well, straight away because it was straight in there which is yep. what it needed to be ah. you didn't need you, you know the the uh, rock and roll priest one didn't grab the one we showed was that yesterday right yeah didn't grab us like it that one then it actually looked like it's from the same company who made that oh really it looks like we're well, same logo and everything um, yeah. yeah i story mean story hunter had yeah. we yeah, had we had what you said, like she does this sort of beautiful internal narration and shows us Barcelona and yeah. why she has the love of this, and then kind of bookends it on the back with some reasons why she feels she needs to be altruistic, would have had a lot more emotion to me. But she made a nice piece. It had a beginning, a middle, and end. It had everything it needed to be a complete story. Yeah, yeah. it was yeah. it was great. I mean, it, it was it, it we missed a few things. What do you feel about the way it looked? You know, it's, it's yeah, worth touching it was on. Gritty. People, some people will look at it and go, oh, I don't want to look at that. It doesn't look nice, well, but, but it doesn't matter. Well, really. I like it, actually. She's doing a gritty thing, and it's gritty it looking. Gritty. Yeah. yeah. City, subways are gritty. It would look weird if it was all done on a movie. You know, beautifully and smooth. No, and shots no, and brain no, shots. No, 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 no. no, there are, it's, it's, it's about, and that's what a lot of people forget, is there is a specific <laughs> style. Uh, it's, I, I personally think it should, things should reflect what they are. And of this course. reflects exactly what it is. I mean, it was handheld. Uh, yeah, you know, yeah. that's when you want exactly. to be handheld. Yeah. You want to show, you want to add I'm to sure the she energy. Had no permission to be shooting there. Uh, you know, they probably know. turned the other way well, because they're friends. Her. Of well, they, yeah, yeah, right. they, they say, you know, yeah. it says in there that she has a good relationship with the security. Yeah. yeah. So maybe, you know. Yep. I know. I mean, yep. is it is it a positive thing for Barcelona, this, or a negative thing? Is yeah, it really. All for, the, all for the public transport system because, you know, they say that, yeah. you know, they're, they're happy that she's there, but it's actually highlighting that there's a problem and yeah. the actual people who are paid the security aren't doing their job so hence she has to go in for three hours a day to do it well so there could be an, you know for yeah, them but you the filmmaker that's again we go to this yesterday it's not his job his job is to tell a story yeah, yeah. and that's the job that he's telling you I know remote discussion but this is i mean that's a valuable yeah. tool yeah. for that yeah, yeah i love things which leave us you know leave questions to be answered everything's been neatly tied up on every single question to be answered oh yeah it makes me curious i want to know more about something yeah, yeah, yeah. and it, it's not Barcelona is not alone in this problem. London is an equally do we difficult problem. Yeah, we have we have pickpockets. <laughs> Good please. God, yeah. for hundreds and hundreds of years, please. Yes, yeah. it's hideous. I tell you, yeah. if anybody's going to <laughs> Photokina this week, um, that's the worst place of yeah. all the shows I've been to. Photokina is just hideous. There, it's I had a wallet stolen. Everybody I knew had something stolen last oh time. Man. Wow! So uh, there should be something. They may make a sequel to this. Yeah. It should be a pickpocket hunter, huntress of Photokina coming no, up no. this week. I lost I lost a wallet in London the other week on a bus. It's not yeah. good. Anyway. We don't have these problems in America, though, no, because you. Think I live in a big city. I've never lost a, a thing in my life. What? Well, this is a never. this is a this is a group of individuals whose whole livelihood has been reduced to robbing. And this is a way of robbing without really getting busted by the law. It yeah. is a, a tacit kind of agreement that somehow this level is permissible and they don't really do anything to, to control it. Yeah, it was a nice little insight. We're gonna yep. watch um, something completely different now. Something called Hard Turn. It's number 32 on our list, guys. And let's see where this takes us. Mm.
smell nice? Hey. Why do you smell nice? So, Why do you smell nice? Why do you smell nice? I have a date. A good pig? At least he has a car. I have a car. No, you have a disaster. Okay, before you shit all over me, I'm trying to keep my head clear. Gotta get this job. I know. Are you still using the same resume? The printer's not working. Joe! What? It has spelling mistakes all over it. We are not in a relationship anymore. You lost the right to that. Oh, lucky me. I still get to dig you out of a ditch every day. How's your athlete's foot? How's that pimple on your ass? How's your bloating? How's your hairy back? I miss you, Sherry. Come on, Joe. You gotta let go. Let me out. Let me out of the car, Sherry. Let me out. too hard. This is something for me, I mean, straight away, you're very obvious. You know, the audio made it very, very difficult to watch that. Impossible to watch. And yeah. that's it, it yeah. you know, the microphone yeah. sounded like it was on the camera. So and a camera mic on it the... It was a camera mic. Yeah. And this oh. is this is, sums it up, and if it wasn't for us being yeah. here, I wouldn't have finished that. Yeah. I would have got to that first one, as soon as I started getting in the, yeah. the noise in the yeah. car, yeah. 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 and yeah. I was struggling. I don't even it get it. You. It loses What's you. the story? I don't know, I, I could barely hear what they were saying, so I completely yeah. disconnected. Well, basically, they, was they started an and argument, yeah. and then he got out, and it's like, but I... I but now, I lost it at that point. I mean, maybe they said something in the car about yeah. the guy that died, but I don't but didn't, know didn't that. Too, but this, this is absolutely key, and this is we, we talk about this all the time. I talked about it. Uh, every time I talk about... Uh, it, it, gear that you need to get and things you need to think about with audio yeah. we talked about it when we were doing documentaries earlier talking with dan chung um <coughs> sound never yeah. forget how important sound is no it's so and if you've got the best script in the world you're not yeah. going to hear it yeah. Yeah. i got a you cinematographer said. here where do you rank video over sound well i did sound for about eight years so i do have an understanding on it and our sound guy on 24 won emmys every year for four years straight because we gave him the permission to put the mic where he needed to put it. But essentially, this is a classic scenario, and we were in that a hundred times. Keith is in the car with somebody, and you gotta hear the dialogue. And if you're not running hypercardioids from right down there by the gear shift, yeah. or a couple of stick-ons up in the, in the visor, yeah. as close as you can get them. And it's all about rigging those two mics. What about a body mic? or a body mic but somehow in the car the actual mics in the car are sometimes better yeah. but road noise if you have the window open you're dead yeah right away and uh, it's just so so important two labs with iPhones yeah. running road software would have been 
perfect for that situation. I mean, I mean that was you like a minute. hundred bucks, you know. I w- they could have they could have eighty yarded it. It was a minute long. Yeah, well, they should have done that <laughs> after, and it's not Offense. that hard to do. Yeah, no, you, not you're nowadays. You're in editorial, and you say, "Oh my God, we can't use this. It's unacceptable." Get the voices back, put them in a room, mm. loop it. Software's available. Yeah. You can but look it up online and figure out how to do but looping. I'm glad we showed this because um, it wasn't planned, but it's glad we showed this because it really it highlights. We've, we've seen stuff with great audio the past yeah. couple of days, yep. and you need to see stuff with bad audio to really understand yeah. why we bang on about it all the time. Yeah. Every time we say, you mustn't forget it, and we say how great the sound was, this shows you why you must have good sound. Right. Yeah. Clearly. Yeah. I've talked about it with you. I've talked about it with you in interviews. <laughs> yes. That <laughs> yeah. your sound is more important than your video. Yes. You got a whole hall here of imagers yeah. Yeah. and yeah. people all concerned about the image, but theoretically I can live with a bad image. I cannot tolerate or understand no, your story no, with no. bad sound. No, Ho- Hollywood is ruthless about it. And I'm always amazed when I find that looping is being done on scenes that we thought were well covered. Yes. And they come back and say, Kiefer would say, well, I have to loop this line. And he said, why? Well, it just wasn't. Right. The team of people in post said, I can't understand what he's saying. Yeah. You know, and it's like, Done. Luke. I, I wish we would do a whole day that was just not about picture at all. That was just yeah. all about sound. Yeah. The previous one we saw, the Barcelona one, was bad. You know, effectively badly shot. Didn't look nice at all. Yeah. But it, it the sound, the was, sound was. You know, it was over modulating. Type. We yeah. heard uh, clearly. We yes. heard everything that was being yeah. said, and that's yeah. what's key. And yeah. then we see the next one, and it's it, you know it looked nice in places. Had some yeah. nice looking shots in there. Yeah. But. Just complete, and it shows you we will put up with average looking images yeah. if we can hear what's going on. But we will, right. even if it's the most sexy, beautiful images in the world, yeah. if, we, if there's dialogue or anything, we can't hear it, we're, we're lost. Yeah. We're gone. I just feel yeah. the young people have, are, are, have a real, they think that if they can create a real sexy picture, that they're a movie maker. Yeah. But you know, you don't have the luxury of having a sound guy, yeah. a real quote sound man, then you need to start investing money in sound gear and don't get an epic. I'm not, not telling people to not get an epic. Yeah. I don't want to get flamed, but get a lesser quality camera so that you can afford high end sound gear or get it's a sound so man. It's so cheap now. I know. And that's it's a like very, and that's two hundred dollars and two phones. What? Two, two, pe- phones. That's two people. It's a very yeah. simple audio. To, to get that. Yeah, oh, no, that was that a given. A car is a challenge, yes. but, but two labs hidden body under mics, the yeah. body mics running to yeah. iPhones. Done. Yeah. It's like they, they could run them to one, one of these, uh, what do you call that thing? Uh, a Zoom. Oh, right, yeah, absolutely. I mean, yeah. that's it. You're done. Yeah. That yeah. thing's yeah. 200 yeah. bucks. Yeah. You got yeah. real yeah. sound. Yeah. Yeah, all right, yeah. let's Boys, move on. We haven't got long in the show. I mean, um, how much we got left? We've got like six minutes. Let's run a clip. All right, we'll watch one last thing. We're what do you guys, uh, let's, let's let them pick. We have, ca- no, 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 they're, they're just going to show something really weird, probably. We're going to see something uh, called Capsule, which is number 36. I know it how is, long is, is it? short, don't worry. Okay, it is short. Okay. Capsules. Hard to tell. I mean, I don't know if it was. It was yeah, a sound mix I think was the, here, the, the mix ruined by the mix. 
the Another mix. sound problem. Yeah. Ruined if, by the mix. If, right when I needed yeah. to hear what she was saying, the music swelled and I lost it. Yeah. I'm hoping that that, that our monitor here is, no, is yeah. accurate. No, no, no. I yeah. it was the mix was bad. No, I mean our audio monitor. But they but yeah. it's but still fair, ruined yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, no. It, it, it's yeah, I hear I you, man. I, I hear you. I think it was just a mix because you know you don't know how people listen to things or how people are going to watch things, and you need to make it work. Excuse me. Different things. What they do is they get the shittiest speakers yeah. on the desk in a <laughs> million dollar suite and they listen to it on those. The aura tones. Yes, because <laughs> that's how people watch. So what I do when, when I put something online is I will I'll put it up on Vimeo privately and then I'll watch it across different things just to just make sure it works. Your iPad everything. is the best my one. My iPhone, my iPad, and just have a look yeah. to yeah. see. Yeah. Because you never know. You never know what it's going to look like. You do your best and you, you know, but with audio, uh, absolutely, I, oh. I edit with speakers, then I'll go mono. And I'll use headphones just yes. to make sure that... Yeah, I'm going to give one yeah, piece yeah, yeah, of yeah. advice on that because I, I work with editors all the time, my whole life doing this. One of the things you need to do when you do your mix is do it at a very low volume because if it's, if it's loud, you get what they call adaption. You start... Yeah. You end up making yeah. it louder yeah. and louder and louder yeah. and louder. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. You, you do your mix at a very, very quiet level so you can just barely hear the voice. Yeah. And then yeah. you bring your music in so that it works. And then you can do what you said. You can listen with headphones. But uh, headphones are dangerous to me because... I don't edit with headphones. I, don't, I yeah. don't do it. I do it. I listen to it once it's done just to yeah. make sure sh- I can have right. it listen across different things. I, like, I want to I see. So that's why I feel that I don't think it's our monitoring here. I think that's basically yeah. what it is. No, I think they ruined it in the mix. Yeah. yeah. Now what about the that. story? I'm not sure. I mean, it was nice shots in there. The story got, t- it was it a got time capsule. Yeah. I don't know it what was, it, yeah, yeah, it was. It was about a time only, capsule, obviously. The reason I know it's time capsule because it's called the capsule, but I wasn't quite sure. Something about mommy. Uh, sure also, we I, I, I felt that they took away the moment when I should have seen it being opened by her. Yeah. Oh, yeah, right. That was the payoff. Yeah. And I <laughs> felt cheated out of it. Well, unfortunately, you know in I mean? the internet, the payoff is where we have tons of problems here, you know. Yeah. Because the stories, they don't, they don't, but it was that. right there. You, you were ready for it. Oh, I know. It's like, I mean. And I'm like, they cut away, you know? Yeah. I, I wanted to see those things in the box. You I, know? I, I thought that the mother died or something. You know, she's speaking to her mother. Yeah. So but later. No, she's speaking to herself. No, she said, I hope my, I hope mommy will blah, blah. Didn't she, wasn't she saying that? No, I thought that that was, that was her putting it in the, in the ground to discover later as a, as in a young adult, you know? Well, she that was what it mommy. said to me. Well, I didn't, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Well, it was you know. fighting the dialogue. Yeah, right. It music. was hard. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. But uh, that piece could probably be really fabulous if it just... Recut. Re- no, lower remix. the... L- remix. Mm. And put that twist in there that makes us get well, the story. Yes, the w- the, it wasn't... It wasn't well enough delineated when you were in real time and when you were in the past. Exactly. They could have used a, do- a device that took me there because I was a little confused because oh, there's wait. definitely a time thing there, right? Now you're hitting me. Is the mind. older person her Absolutely. older? Oh, Absolutely. wow. Okay, see, I'm that, a bit of an idiot. That's what I got out of it. Right? Yeah, I think you're and right. I wanted to be made to believe that it was historic and that yeah. now we're in the present. Exactly. I with not, uh, with yeah. a stronger device, either it, you know, in terms of the way it was cut or framed or the quality of the image desaturate. I mean, I don't know, but some, yeah, you know that would be saying? great. Oh, totally. Now yeah. I get, now I, I see the piece. I see the mission of that. I didn't yeah. get it before. I thought that was her mom or I don't know. I don't know. I don't, th- I mean, it's certainly no info, you know, you, you shouldn't have to go to the Vimeo info. To what does the video info say? Very little apart from it's, it's starring two models, one from the Ford agency, one from LA models. Yeah. They're beautiful uh, girls. And it's, the music was composed. Who cares about it? It said that it talked about the agency they're from. Yeah, the credits for the credits for the oh actual for the credits, okay, the credits, all right. But it doesn't say there's no about description. It. No, no, it's got a nice use of slow mo. Yeah, yeah. I yeah. mean, the shots are gorgeous. Again, yeah. I- yeah. that's a bit of relevance yeah, to yeah, yeah. the storytelling. Yeah, yeah. You know, I mean, it's lovely, but so we've got a couple of minutes left. I think we should, you know, do we have any clip that's like a thirty second? Let's just have a nice little final summer. There's no thirty <laughs> second. Clip, <so laughs> let's, just have a, let's just talk a about. Spot. You know, we're never going to see each other again. I'm yes, we are. Now, are we? <laughs> well, we're going to be doing the show. This was a great way to see if Ronnie could take over from you, and clearly he's better. <laughs> yes, he's so better. Yes, you know, it's better. You know, we, you know well, it's. We let's talk about how we're going to do it. In the next six months, we're going to be coming back again live from yeah. Zacuto. Live from, from Zacuto. Chicago. <laughs> from yeah. Chicago, from Planet, Planet I'll Zacuto. Come up. You'll come up? Sure. Well, we're doing come a up little on one weekend. Yeah, we're doing a little he differently. He gets to go there, but I still have to be. Well, you're too expensive. You got to fly business class. I can't so afford does he. that. Yeah. No, Rodney's a little more. 
<laughs> he'll go no. with the flow. <laughs> but and he's not coming from that far. But we're we're going to do it this way. We're going to yeah. do it in, like in a studio like this. But we can Skype people in. Oh, great! So it's going to be, be nice because we can have guests. Yeah, we can, like and you can be, you know, wherever you are in China or Thailand or wherever this God is a knows great you show. are. I it think it's helpful uh, to young people. Young hugely, people need yeah. advice, yeah. and we're, uh, you know, I think we got to say one thing. You know, don't take offense to what we're saying. We're not trying to be pricks. We're trying to give you honest advice from yeah. older folks. Well, I guess hey, we're going to say this may be on that couch sofa <laughs> thing. There. Young fella back here, you know. Yeah, I don't uh, know. We're a different generation, Steve. We're all about, you know, 60s, 50s, 40s. So, yeah. It's it's a good mix. Yeah, we need to get younger people in the next generation. Critics, no. the next generation. Why? I mean, the younger people I'm hoping are actually looking for advice. I get lots of emails from people that say your show is helpful to me. Yeah. I watch it. I try to get advice and listen. Yeah, I mean, we're yeah. definitely going to do loads more of these because yeah. it is, it's also a chance to get exposure for films, which, you know, maybe won't get seen. Yeah, and I think that's important. Yeah, and, and I how wonderful that, that they're even out there now. Yeah, this so is, just, you know, five amazing. years ago. I know. It's amazing. <laughs> it's, it's been lovely. And the quality is really again. good. Yeah. It's been yeah. wonderful seeing you all. Yeah. Thank yeah. you, Great. Rodney. I know. Thank for you. Thank you for being here. Don't forget to invoice Steve. Pleasure, pleasure. It's Zakuto at Chicago. There you go. And uh, join us um, soon, I hope. Soon. i got to work out the whole technical aspects. Fantastic. Yeah. Thank you very much for joining us. Yep. All right.